So we've been provided with some information about Greg's pay, and our job is to use this information to work out how much he earned in May. So if we start off uh, with what his basic pay is, well, his basic pay is £530. So we'll write that down, £530. He's going to get that, whatever happens. He gets 5% of the cost of all car insurances he sells, 5% of all car insurances and 10% of all home insurances he sells. He sells six car insurances and four home insurances. So we'll work out how much he gets for those. So let's do the six car insurances first. So the car insurance gives us £200 and we're told that he sells six car insurances and he gets 5% of the money taken. So he doesn't get the money um, that it's sold for, um, but he gets 5% of what he sells. So let's do that. So it's, he sold 6 times 200, and that is 1,200, and he gets 5% of 1,200. Well, 10% of 1,200 is 120, so 5% is 60. So Greg earns another £60 from his car insurance. Now the home insurance, he gets 10%, but he's only sold 4 home insurances, so it's 4 times 350. Well, two 350s are 700, so four 350s will be 1,400. And he gets 10% of that, which is a nice £140. So we add that as well to our running total. So we've got three numbers um, to add up. I'll circle them here. 5, 30, 60, and 140. Well, 140 and 60 is 200, and 500 is 730. I'm sure I said 530, so 140... 60 is 200 and 530 is 730. So the total amount of money Greg earns in May is 730 pounds.